Hi, I'm Gagan Lutra, Product Marketing Manager at Cypress Semiconductor. In this video, we're going to look at our brand new kit, the CY8C Kit 024, Capsons Proximity Shield. Proximity sensing is redefining user experiences for end products, including consumer products, home appliances, and industrial goods. Consumers want sleek products with a rich and convenient user experience that can do things like respond to gestures, wake up automatically when a user approaches, and of course have long battery lives. At the same time, these products need to have reliable performance and of course low cost. Capacitive proximity sensing works on the principle that a capacitive button set for higher sensitivity can be used to detect the presence of a person or nearby objects without any actual physical contact. However, Capacitive proximity sensing is extremely susceptible to noise and consequently, it's difficult to implement a reliable solution. Cypress's industry-leading and proven Capsons technology solves this problem and lets you implement a reliable proximity sensing solution with improved noise immunity, which even works in the presence of liquids. Our proximity sensing solutions are based on the new PSOC4 architecture that's optimized for both low cost and low power. The CY8C Kit 024 Capsons Proximity Shields enables you to evaluate the proximity sensing capabilities of Cypress's Capsons technology. This shield features six proximity sensors and six LEDs laid out as per our design guidelines. It's also got a three millimeter thick overlay that covers the proximity sensors. The sensing loop on the periphery of the kit can be used to sense large distances. The loop in the middle can be used to enable a driven shield that improves the proximity sensing distance or enables liquid tolerant designs. And then the four proximity sensors on each side of this square-shaped shield can be used for gesture detection. You can use this Arduino compatible shield with these headers to connect to baseboards like the PSOC4 Pioneer kit, such as the CY8C kit 040 that I have here today, or the ever popular CY8C kit 042, you can also use this shield with, uh, with standard Arduino shields, but of course you won't get as good of a Capsons performance out of it. One thing to remember is that this shield is a passive shield. It doesn't have any active components on it like a microcontroller or a touch controller. It just has the proximity sensing loops and then the LEDs on it. To get started, we'll go to the kit's webpage, which is cypress.com slash CY8C kit 024. This page includes information and documentation pertaining to this Capsons Proximity Shield and has links to the PSOC Pioneer kits and uh, also PSOC Creator. The file section has the kit guide, the quick start guide, release notes, application notes, board schematics, and most importantly, example projects to get you started with this solution. We'll now walk through one of the example projects. And to get started, please ensure you have the following. The Capsons Proximity Shield, CY8C Kit 024, a PSOC Pioneer kit, either the PSOC 4000 based Kit 40 or the PSOC 4200 based Kit 42. For the purpose of this video, I'll be using the Kit 40, which is based on the PSOC 4000 device. In addition, you need a Windows based PC with PSOC Creator 3.0 Service Pack 1 or later installed. You can download this for free from our website. And then of course, the example projects for this kit can be downloaded from the same website and extracted onto your PC. One thing to keep in mind is there's a jumper J14 on this kit that you want to remove. It's supplying power to the RGB LED that we're not going to use in this example. Instead, I want to be powering the LEDs on, on the Arduino shield. So just go ahead and remove that jumper. I will now use the included mini USB cable that comes with the kit uh, and plug it into my computer. We'll now go ahead and open the uh, example project for proximity sensing that you downloaded from the website. If you are new to PSOC Creator and would like to learn more, please go to www.cypress.com slash Creator to look at all the tutorial videos. If you click on the top design, you can see the PSOC components that we use for creating this project. We have the Capsons component, which is set for manual tuning and configured to have one single proximity sensor called PROX and four buttons. The CY8C kit 040 is driving the large proximity loop on the periphery of the kit. As per the current component settings and the layout of the kit, you should be able to achieve approximately 10 centimeters of a sensing distance with this loop. The four proximity sensors on the inside are set up as buttons in the component, but are actually grounded on the kit. This is done to improve the noise performance. Also, 
you'll notice that a driven shield is enabled on the middle loop in this tab to improve the proximity sensing distance. You also have a TCPWM component, which is set up as a timer in this case to control the brightness of our five LEDs based on the position of your hand measured by the proximity sensing loop. Additionally, you have an easy I2C component that's used to implement a CapSense tuner and a software transmit UART component that is used to send raw data to my PC. You can refer to the proximity sensing CapSense application note for more details on the role of each component in this design. Since this is an example project, the firmware code is based on the PSOC component APIs and it's already written in the main.c file. When you build the project, PSOC Creator will generate a hex file. Following the completion of the build, you can program the PSOC 4000 device on this kit using the generated hex file by clicking the program button. Now that the PSOC 4000 device is programmed with this project, let's test it out. Now you notice, as I move my hands closer to the shield, the LEDs light up, and in fact they get brighter as I get closer to the kit and dimmer as I, as I move further away. Uh, based on this setup and this example project, you should be able to achieve a sensing distance of about 10 centimeters, but the PSOC 4000 solution can be set up to achieve distance of up to 30 centimeters based on your firmware and your board layout. There's a couple more example projects on the website, one that includes gesture detection with uh, captions proximity, and the other one that showcases the liquid tolerance of this solution. This was just a short introduction to the Capsons Proximity Shield. For more information and to buy the kit, please visit our website www.cypress.com/cy8ckit024. Thank you.